this particular video we're going to be looking at questions that involve compound interest and I have mentioned before that the easiest way of dealing with this is by using the formula which is original amount which in this particular case is going to be 2400 multiplied by multiplier which we know is going to be seven and a half percent and then n which is the number of years and actually that's what the question is asking you to do so they want to find out the number of years it takes for Jaden if he invests two thousand four hundred pounds to achieve three thousand four hundred and forty five pounds fifty one p and actually it's all about guesswork with this what we do is we say well the original amount was two thousand four hundred the multiplier is going to be 7.5%. Now, as I've mentioned in previous videos, what that means with compound interest is that you get actually 107.5%. So 100% of the value you keep within the account, then you get an extra 7.5% on top. So let's just look at that for a minute. What that means is I can rewrite it as 107.5 divided by 100 because that's what percent means. It means out of 100. So I can now change that to a decimal by dividing through by 100 and moving the decimal point two places. So I get 1.075 and in this particular case that's the multiplier that I'm going to use 1.075 now I don't know the number of years but I'm going to take a guess and the guess I'm going to say is four years okay so if I work it out at four years I get 3,205 pound and 13 P so not the 3,445 that I'm trying to get to so I'm going to guess again I'm going to say well this time it's going to be uh, let's say five years and if I feed that into my calculator well I actually get 3,445 pounds 51 P which answers the question so actually Jaden invested for five years, which is the value of N. Okay, I hope that's okay for you. Please do add a comment below if you're not sure. Have a look at the rest of the videos in this particular series. Uh, subscribe to the site and I'll look forward to seeing you inside the next video.